Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Paige here once again with another video. In this video, we're going to be going through some things that Andrew Kreisberg uh, said in an interview uh, in regards to The Flash Season 2. And he basically did like this sort of like lightning round session, I guess you could say, where he provided uh, quick responses on each of the Season 2's main characters, I guess you could say. Not every single char uh, character, sorry, but the main characters. So they're not really that mysterious. Like, he did they did say that they were sort of mysterious, but they basically just sort of sum up um, what some of the storyline for each character will be in Season 2. So let's get straight into it. So with Barry Allen, he said, new love. So obviously we know that he's going to get a new love interest. There's no surprise in that. So I wasn't too affected by that one. With Iris West, he said, face from the past. Now, this opens up a lot of doors. This could mean Wally West, or this could mean someone that was previously hurt in her life that does come back into her life and either causes trouble for her or trouble for the rest of the Flash team. Caitlin Snowy had Brewer. Obviously, you know, like, I'm cold, Brewer. But, um, obviously, this is obviously towards Killer Frost, and we know that she's going to be going through some Killer Frost issues in this season. We don't really know how. It's going to be really interesting to see, and I am unbelievably excited to see it. With Cisco, metahuman was the word to describe him, and I think that's all. They could have said vibe, but that's just not subtle at all. Subtle, at all. Uh, subtle might I say. What am I trying to say? Subtle. But even then, metahuman isn't that subtle either. So, obviously, we know Cisco. Even in season one, he was going through some sort of vibe transformations, and in season two, I'm hoping that he does go through the full vibe transformation and be officially becomes a vibe. Now, I did a video on Cisco and his whole transformation into Vibe and different ways in which he could turn into Vibe, and I will leave that linked in the top right-hand corner if you want to go check that out, and I will leave it linked in the description. For Dr. Wells, or Harrison Wells, whatever you want to call him, the word that he used to describe him was alive, question mark, or alive? Alive? <laughs> there you go. But, um, yeah, so we know that Harrison Wells is going to be alive. Now, there's different theories on... Someone said that they have confirmed it, like it was confirmed, but I want to wait and see in the show before I wonder how he's going to be coming in. Apparently, it's like a different version of him, so that'll be pretty interesting to see, and i um, pretty interested to see that. With Ronnie Raymond, the word to describe him was bravery, and this opens up a lot of theories. What does this mean? Is he going to sacrifice himself? Is he going to die, obviously, maybe to protect the Flash team, or maybe, maybe he dies fighting Killer Frost. Who knows what happens, and maybe he was fighting just to save his wife, so... It's pretty interesting to see what that means, because um, Robbie Amell, who plays Ronnie Raymond, um, I'm not too sure if he really wants to stay. Like, I think he wants to stay, but he's also got... He's been in a couple of movies as well, so he might want to move on to the movie side of things, but I don't know. Maybe he does want to stay on The Flash, and maybe Bravery just means he's going to be a really brave character throughout this season. With Jay Garrick, the word to describe him was broken, so this might be a reason as to why he comes to Earth-1, why he goes and changes universes and stuff like that. And, uh, he d like, in the trailer, he looks like he's a bit worried, and, like, he's come to Barry Allen for a reason, to stop Zoom, so, uh, maybe Zoom does something to him in his life, maybe he kills, maybe his wife or something like that, so, it'll be pretty interesting to see what Jay Garrick's storyline is in Season 2. And finally, we have Patty Spivett, and the word to describe her was delightful, and she does seem like a delightful woman, so, and she, also she looks like she's pretty brave as well, she wants to get in there and sort of help Team Flash out with their issues, even though she doesn't have any superpowers at all, yet, yet, I do have to say yet, I don't think they'd do it in the show yet, uh, at all maybe, they might not do it at all, but uh, she does look like she's pretty brave as well. So thanks for watching guys, leave any opinions in the comments section below, what do you think the storylines, or what these words mean for each character, maybe for Face from the Past, you might have a different thing for Iris West, or maybe even for Bravery for Ronnie Raymond, you might have something else, leave them in the comments, leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll catch you on the next video guys, goodbye.